Hello there guys, welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Late Night, and here we are with another part right where we left off. The Sims are at home, um, just sleeping. Alan Stanley is actually, um, still here <laughs> in Ruben's bed, poor thing, so, um, luckily for us, Ruben actually had a decent amount of sleep. I'm just gonna have him take a nap, and he's starting to feel sick. God, I guess Auden gave it to him. That sucks. Is everyone in the house sick? Cassie isn't yet, so... That's good. We do not want her getting ill. God, no. Um, she works in nine hours, so let's see what will we have to do. She'll just have to take a shower when she wakes up and eat a little bit. I don't think that'll be a problem. Um, and yeah, there are a few things I want to get done in this part. For example, Auden wants to skinny dip in a pool, and I thought, why the heck not? Just literally try to go into someone's backyard or something in the town, or just like find the most random place ever to do it. I think we're gonna probably try to sneak in to um, celebrity party, maybe try to get her some celebrity status, do something like that. Um, and of course, we still have to finish writing her book. Um, Cassie, what she needs to do is, uh, again, we're trying to get her that promotion already because she's still only on level one of film. And she's been there for literally like the whole time that we've been playing this, which is ridiculous. Um, what I want to do on the side real quick is actually open up the comment section of my last video. So I will actually uh, leave this playing. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me just click play. And we'll just leave it playing for um, the time being. So uh, we'll see when someone wakes up or something. But let me open the comment section on the last video. See what I need to update myself on. I, I read it last time. I just, whenever it comes to time to recording this again, because I have a... I like to record every series that I have, an episode of every series I have before I record another episode of another one. So for example, I have recorded this and I upload it. That means I have to record everything else before I can upload this again. Sometimes I don't because I'm not in the mood and <laughs> I just love the way he woke up this morning. Just look at him. It's like, oh, nope, I wasn't asleep. Nope, not at all. But let's see the top comments say, um, you guys were recommending a whole bunch of like, names for books and stuff like that and someone said um 50 shades of pizza <laughs> or which we could just put 50 f flavors of pizza something like that i think that'd be cool um let's see what else there was something i god i don't even remember but a lot of you guys said you like the name pizza junk for our band so we're gonna keep it that way i did actually move some things around in the apartment so i'll show you guys that um, I just move the drum kit over here, move the piano over here, change the colors up. That So, you know, it'll just kind of go with the girls a little more. So here we have Cassie's drums, Auden's piano with the purple seat. And if I could get the lights on in here. Sorry, Alan Stanley, don't want to wake you up. But I think auto lights is actually on for here. So, Ruben, if you could just walk in here so the lights will turn on, I will really appreciate that. Get on over here. Get on my connecting. All right, and I just pretty much put posters on the wall back here because it looked so like blank and awkward back there. And I kind of did it along the colors of pizza. So you can see reds, oranges, and yellows. Um, I put some lockers over here just to give the industrial feel. Crates with records in it from Modish Kitten if you guys want to download that um, custom content. A poster and then his base is still there. But that's pretty much all I really added in. I moved some Sims into town as well. So this should be fun. We should be seeing some new faces and people around town that I created myself. I took my time to create Sims uh, to move in. And if you guys were at my live stream yesterday, you would see some of the people I moved into town. So yeah, super fun, super fun. Um, you, there's something he needs to do. We still haven't gotten him that job. So let's go do that now. We're gonna get him the part-time job at the grocery store because that makes sense. Auden, you should be waking up soon. And Cassie should, get up soon as well. I think she's had more than enough sleep, but I love to usually have the um, full sleep, uh, what's it called, moodlet? But yeah, so there's some new sims, um, I think in this apartment building, the apartment building back here, um, some of the houses over here, and I think that's where I moved most of them. There's an, the special sim, I haven't moved him into town yet, the one that I've been saying I'm gonna move in, but we'll see him eventually, and that's really it. Um, I have no main, <laughs> I guess, point to this part. I want to have them go back out to maybe one of the bars or something like that and maybe audition for a gig because everyone kind of wants to play a gig at this point, except for her because, oops, I kind of forgot about that. And he wants to buy a dryer. Boy, we do not need that. Not necessary. Uh-uh. 
but we're just gonna go back to the house. I hope these people, can you wake up? Wake up. We ain't got no time for this. So except job as grocery store clerk. Lord knows he's probably gonna get fired within the first day, but whatever. Uh, oh look, and Alan Stanley finally woke up. You better make the bed. And if he only makes his side, I will be so angry. Oh, we're gonna ask him to behave? No, he's behaving. He's just making the bed. We don't have rude guests. Let him do what he wants. That's nice. How is that rude? Whoa, Auden. Okay, you want to make the bed yourself then? I will let you. But Alan Stanley is up. I noticed um, actually before he woke up, I removed this moodlet from her queue, but she wanted to go take a picture of him in her sleep, like when he was asleep. And I'm just like, okay, Auden, stop. You're scaring me. As for Cassie, we need her to get up already. Come on, Cassie, wake up. Cassie, wake up. Yes, good. So she's just gonna call a repair technician, um, take a shower, and we'll talk to Alan Stanley before he leaves, hopefully. So we will, um, friendly, we'll, uh, ask about show, because he's watching something, I guess. Do a little bit of gossiping, just some interactions so that we can get this friendship rolling. Uh, because we do want to become better friends. We need to get some celebrity skill at some point, because that is something she wants to do, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, she wants to gain celebrity star level and reach celebrity star level one. So I want to get that done. As well as, let's see, um... Oh, I'm reading the wrong comment section, aren't I? I think I am. Was I reading the wrong comment section? I think I was, sorry. Let's go through this again. I was reading it for the last, last video. So let's open this up. Come on. Come on, YouTube, you can decide to function. Oh god, and Auden was having a sneeze attack back here. You're stressed out. I know she's probably not gonna write now that she is stressed out, so we'll have her relax a little bit. We'll have her um, eat an autumn salad and watch some TV. Join him. Why the heck not? I mean, he's watching TV. I don't see a problem in joining him in his um, whatever the hell it is that he's doing. Are you done with the shower? Come on. Come on, go talk to Ellen Stanley. You can do it. They both have to go to work in a few hours anyway, so we'll probably just catch the carpool together. So how are you doing? He hasn't even changed no, his clothing again. yet. That's nice. Um, for a second, it looked like the sink was smoking back here. So, anywho, how are you guys watching the video? This is like the mundane usual morning stuff, so it's probably not too interesting to watch. Um, do, 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 do. Okay, I'm gonna see. Oh crap, the carpool's here. Alright, so we'll just have them go to work then. I heard Mars Champion acted quite rudely to Sean Rhodes. Sean Rhodes. Oh, that's one of the Sims I made. That's interesting. Wait, he's dumpster diving? You're not gonna find pizza here, Ruben. Oh my gosh. Th this. This describes him just so much, so damn much. Alright, have fun. I guess the thing that he found could make us some money, but now you smell. You don't work today, do you? Nope, not for three days. Yeah. We need you to now take a shower. Now you're nauseous. Look at this. You did this to yourself. You just made yourself more sick. So go home. We'll do what we have to do. Um... As for you, you need to de-stress. Watch some pe something. Oh, and she wants to jam. That's cute. All right. Why not? It gets your skill up and everything. I don't see a problem with it. So go play the piano. Besides, she does need to get that skill up. I don't know why I thought their piano skill was better. Imagine if I were to have the magician at this point. That would have been terrible. Um, she wants to throw a party as well. Do we know enough people to throw a party? No, we're not like too well acquainted, so I think we're gonna go out, make some actual friends, and then um, throw a party. Because at this point, the only friend other than the people in our household is Alan Stanley, and that'd kind of be a flop party, and we can't throw flop parties. Mm -mm. No, no. Not allowed. So, yeah, shouldn't you be going to work, Cassie? You're missing work! Damn it, Cassie! You always do something like this. Damn it! <laughs> Have you guys noticed something either always goes wrong at work, or she's late to work, or it's something always revolving around work. I, we need this promotion so bad. 
yet, you know, she's still not at work. And Alan Stanley, you're still not at work. What are you doing here? Um, just really, it's, it's a pretty good question. Let's greet him. Auden, let's do this. Let's socialize with our so-called rude guest. Get on over there. Talk to Alan Stanley. We should actually tell him it's like... Oh, she's laughing at him, too. She's like, oh, God. Do not stick your fingers in her face. Excuse me? Yeah, he's... Ooh, ooh, this is not good. Ooh, this ain't going well. Ooh, ooh, she gonna fight him. Um, let's see. T talk about skill. What does he even do again? I think he's a director. Probably likes writing. Um, try to impress celebrity. Talk about occupation. Um, he's in the film career. No so Starla. I'm assuming that will go well. Yeah, so it's good. We're gonna continue to do the same thing. So talk about film and try to impress celebrity, talk about skill, and then writing. And by then hopefully all is well. Okay, and there's that. <laughs> so she wants to befriend Alan Stanley. Why not? So we'll remove this, become friends with Mi Michel, however you say his name. And we'll also remove the meat of vampire. Although we do want to meet vampires because that is part of late night. We'll have to save that for later. So we'll ask him about his career even though we already know what it is. Um, ask about alma mater. Let's see what else. Gossip. Get to know. And just random things here and there to get their relationship going. Talk about movies. Yes, that's something we'll actually enjoy talking about. Ruben, you must be home now, right? Yeah, he just got home. <laughs> so he used the potty already. Good, good. Did he shower too? Yes, he did. We want to get him all ready because later when we go to... Oh, wow. Stand in the refrigerator, guys. Let's open the refrigerator and get him something. I feel bad. Come on. There we go. Just grab the autumn salad, even though... <laughs> <laughs> Autumn, Auden, funny. I don't know why I thought her name was Autumn for a second. But um, go grab yourself a, some of this since you're hungry. All right. And how is this conversation going? Hmm. So I guess they're not going to fight. I think they're actually going to get along well. And let's see. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. I had a, a book series idea actually for the series because as I mentioned before they um, the characters of this LP were kind of made off people or characters from a role play a while back and I was thinking maybe we could write a book series off the characters so it would be like um, PCA the book series like the first book would be I guess written about Cassie the second would be about Ruben it would be about random people who were in it so it'd just be this like a really long book series and kind of like in different points of views of the different characters she would just try to get into the characters heads and stuff like that so I think that would be nice and again I will also write the other one that someone suggested so let's put away these leftovers and I think they're not really gonna become that great of friends, so it's fine. But we can try to be funny, because that's what she is. She has a good sense of humor, I'm pretty sure. Alright, funny. Show funny video. Come on. No, where are you going? Show internet cats video. Yes, that's something she would do. Uh, let's see, Ruben Davidson. You want to play with the mirror? I need to see this. What is this? Take photo of celebrity. <laughs> Why does everyone always want to do this? I never understood the function of this. And, uh, but if that's what you please, go right ahead, take a picture. <laughs> Rousy bats. <laughs> okay, so let's see this real quick. Oh no, not the mirrors in the way. Really, Ellen Stanley? Oh my god. I think he actually lost a celebrity star. He just had four stars at the beginning of this. I guess it's because he's hanging out with uncool people like us. Or he's the fact that he missed work today. Or the fact that he's, um... He's just incognito. Maybe he's, like, using our house to, like, hide away from society. Whoa. That could totally be it, if you really think about it. But we're gonna have Ruben, of course, be a lazy bum, catch up on sleep, uh, use this, because when we go out later tonight, he's gonna need to be wide awake. So we're just gonna do this when he wakes up, use the toilet, yada yada. And Auden, let's have you stop talking to Alan Stanley, actually. Who cares? Let him be incognito and hide away. So use, shower, and then continue writing now that we have our computer back. Writing the gosling. I think that'd be fun. 
So go and do this. I'd like to stick around, but I really need to go home and take care of a few things. Call me again soon. All right, well, bye, Ellen Stanley. Hope you had fun hiding out at our house. And, okay, so our sims, really nothing's interesting, or nothing interesting, that is, is going to be happening here for a while. And her, God, it's going down. Her work form is going down. Please tell me we're going to get this promotion today. Please, like, we actually need this. Or let's, like, hang out with the cast members. Will that make this a little easier on us? No, poor work performance is going to go down and we're not going to get the promotion. Great. Great. Please let us get the promotion. Please let us get the promotion. Please. Please, 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 please. please. Honestly, so just hoping that we get it. Come on, please. Nope. Nope. We didn't get it. That sucks. That sucks! She only got 98 simoleons today, too. That totally was not worth it. Getting all stressed out and stuff. Damn, that sucks. That really sucks. And hold on a second, my dog is scratching at my door and she doesn't realize I'm recording. Ugh, god, dog. Okay, sorry about that, but now that Cassie is coming home, I'm just gonna have the rest of the Sims get a little bit ready here, so we're gonna have her eat some leftover waffles or something, and then most of her motives will be fine. We're gonna keep um, the whole getting their fun up, obviously, for when they go out, so that's not a problem. We'll just fast forward a bit. How's Cassie? Everything else for Cassie is fine, so we're just really waiting on everyone else, but that's fine. So, hopefully he doesn't take too long. All right, he's done. We just have to wait for Auden to finish eating. Come on, come on. And where should we go tonight? I was thinking I wanted to go to the grind. So let's actually do that. Um, after she's done eating, I guess she'll be the one to call a cab and everyone will go to the grind. So I'm gonna zoom in here and show you guys a round of what this place looks like. It's supposed to kind of look like an abandoned warehouse. So if you look closely at it, you see like the garages and all that kind of stuff. But when you go inside, it's like this, <laughs> the only person here, or there's two people here, Barry Tenderlove and Aria Trill. So we'll probably try to befriend her since she's a celebrity, but this is what the place looks like. Nothing really back here, the, everything's mainly inside. For example, the tables here, um, and then up here is just a sitting area that honestly no one ever goes up to. <laughs> so this is really where the party is at, right here. All right, let's take a look here. Ooh. See, this is what Ruben needs to learn how to do. I forgot. Ruben should probably start working more on his mixology. We'll do that in the next part, though. Alright, so they're on their way, are they? Are they almost here? Hopefully they are. Alright, so they're not even- they haven't even left their apartment yet. Come on. Come on, guys. Oh, and now Cassie's sick. That's- that's three people. That's three people now. Who's this chick here? I'm not hallucinating, right? Okay, who are you? Danica Trailer. Wow, that's a wonderful name. Oh look, if it isn't Alan Stanley, and he's now taken upon himself to to smell like the grunge. Literally, he's just letting his career go. <laughs> this, okay, this says a lot right here. This. I need a picture of this. Oh, that's that's the video button, love. There we go. <laughs> that's funny though. Oh goodness. Okay, so are they here yet? Nope, it doesn't seem like it, but it seems like someone else is here. So we have Diana Jones who just arrived and now someone else is arriving. So I thought she was on fire. I was gonna be like, this girl is on fire. This girl is on fire. What? What? What's that? Huh? <clears throat> Puberty? Okay, and another person who uh, arrived was Harry Marks. Not to be confused with um, Harry Styles because he looks nothing like him. Oh, and we also have Caitlin Missoni, so we're probably gonna have Ruben go to talk to her because she's a female. <laughs> That's literally so the dumbest thing I've probably said in this time. It's like, because she's a female. That, that He'll go for anything that's a female. Um... So let's see if they can all go inside. One, we're gonna have her 
Uh, buy round drinks for everyone. The heck, she should just spend her whole paycheck. <laughs> That's pretty much her whole paycheck. So she's just gonna spend it and buy drinks for everyone here because she wants to be the life of the party. Uh, let's see, we want to get in the mind of some people here, so you can actually go friendly introduction with very tender love and then just dance. Dance the night away. So, you know, not even dance the night away, dance that book deadline away. Let's do that. So, dance together afterwards. Oh, ooh, what is this? What is this? Alright. Okay, what are you doing? He's gonna kicking dance? Kicking dance, really? You know what I do want him to do? This! This is what I wanted to have him do. Oh, Harry Marks is one step ahead. I think he's gonna be one of the good friends of our household. Yes. You know what? Instead of having him talk to Caitlin Masoni, we're gonna have him come over here talk to this dude. This is gold. This right here is gold. They're gonna be best friends. So you get over here and talk to him. Dance. Yes. Wait, friendly introduction. Hold on. This is perfect. This is so perfect. We're gonna have them dance. And uh, as for having Auden find a pool, I don't think that's gonna happen today. Just cause, well, it, it's not gonna happen. But there we go. We are dancing with Barry Tenderlove and it seems to be going well. Cassie is probably just gonna drink her life away because she's probably hating it. Look how many drinks there are here. Oh my God, this is how much she bought. Well, no wonder it was that expensive. Ooh, you, you, hi, hi, stop, stop walking, where are you going, where do you think you're going, where do you think you're going, <laughs> alright, well, let's see, oh, oh, and this is good too, the main reason I was talking to him was because he was a celebrity, but that could work too, I think today is a su decently successful night, but we're going to talk to him about God, I actually don't know what he does. Damn it. Name drop, Alan Stanley. Let's hope this goes well. <laughs> Alan Stanley? So, uh, do you know Alan Stanley? He's probably like, uh, how about no? Oh no, he approves. He's like, yeah, I know Alan Stanley. He's the smelly guy over there who's losing his celebrity status. Yes. Yes, you know who I'm talking about. Let's name drop him again. I think that's the only um, extra thing we'll have to do here. And that is all we need to do, I'm assuming. Yes. Did she have a- Yes! Cassie finally has a celebrity star. Something went right for her. God. So we're gonna have her befriend this dude. They're gonna be friendly. We're gonna queue a whole bunch of interactions here. Ask about career friendly. Uh, ask about alma mater. Get to know. Gossip. Um, what else? Share secret. Just do a whole bunch of stuff like that. Um... And then we can dance together. I don't see a problem with that. This place has a lot of people here tonight. I am surprised. Like, there's a decent amount of people running around this place. Oh, when I said no one goes up here. Alan Stanley's a freak. <laughs> I said no one goes up here. This is like only where shady people go. And Alan Stanley's hanging up out here by himself. All alone. Alan Stanley, I know you're hiding something. I think we're gonna have to write a book about him. We're gonna have to like observe him from afar and then like write a book about him. That's what's gonna happen. That's what's gonna happen. So get on down here. Get on pop for that thing. This is perfect. This is so perfect that it hurts. Like, can we just, this is to a new friendship. This is to a new beautiful friendship that is rising. And you are going to uh, friendly gossip. L let's interact a little more. Get to know, friendly chat, friendly debate politics. Hell yes. Uh, ask about career, play tag. That's all I want to see right now. That is all I need to see. But if I see that, I will be happy to die right now. All right, so stop dancing. Become friends, please. I would appreciate that. And let's see, we're going to... Um, Oh, we can convince him to make out with people. But no, we we want to get to know him a little bit a little better because he is attractive. So we're gonna do that. Besides, I think Auden needs a little loving, right? So let's try that. And Cassie, who are you talking to? You're still talking to this dude. I think it's going well, so that's fine. These girls are so obviously jealous, like the girls back here. Even Ace Wild is probably jealous. 
kind of looks like he's supposed to work here because <laughs> all how colorful his outfit is <laughs> junzu oh my gosh if you guys watch demo or what i don't actually know how to say his name but i watched that entire lp with like junzu and stuff all right let's see but this is pretty much like the, the start of beautiful new friendships for our sims we said we were gonna go out and make friends and that's exactly what we're doing so we'll just do a whole bunch of other things like rock paper scissors why not um, don't invite him over god no please don't friendly gossip friendly um and these are music he looks like a musician and then just chat why the heck not friendly ask for alma mater did i ask him about his career yet I don't think I did, so we're probably gonna have to do that. Oh, is that what she's doing now? No, that's what we're doing now. Cool. Okay, so let's just do this, ask him about his career, and then play tag. Because that's what you go to clubs for, right? You go to play tag. Are they dancing now? Yes, they are dancing now. Perfect. Ah. Tag, you're it. Oh, yep, he's up. He's up for it. Mm hmm. <laughs> Run! Run! <laughs> yes! <laughs> that is so perfect. This this is probably the best part of late night so far. The best part. Is it bad that I actually want Ruben to get up there, though? Okay, so they're just gonna talk a little bit. And you know what we're gonna do? We're going to ask him to join our group. Why not? Friendly. Ask about alma mater. Oh wait, Ruben, you know what you should do? Okay, stop playing tag and ask him to join our group because what we are going to do... Alright, stop that and we are going to ask to join a group. Everyone, have every one of these people join our group and we're going to end the part with them all going out to eat because I feel like they're all going to be hungry. So, doesn't sound like the worst idea. Plus, this place is going to close in like literally a few seconds. So, hopefully everyone says yes. Yes, I think everyone said yes. So, let's see actually if the little plum bob thingies appear over here. So he said, cool, let's chill. Alright, let's see what's with this person. Um, yes, yes, and yes! Okay, all the people joined us, so we're gonna have them all go out to eat with our sims. And hopefully that brings up the relationship, so eat with group, and then get drinks with group. And I think that's where we are going to end the part because it is almost 30 minutes long and I have stuff that I need to get done. Surprisingly. I know, I have a life. Shocker, right? So um, without further ado, I will see you guys all later. Continue to leave suggestions as to what you want to see down below. And that is just about it. Goodbye.